Hey guys, it's Vixawa and welcome back to Let's Play These Sims 4 Get to Work. So I did some renovations on our little bakery here. Uh, very minor renovations, but renovations nevertheless. So uh, if you'll notice on the outside, I added some like potted plants along the windows just to give it some like greenery. And then I added some plants on the ground right there on like the corners uh, just to give it a little bit of uh, nature. And then I put a little cupcake sign over there on the right uh, just so that people will know that it is a bakery. Yep. And I might uh, do some more stuff to the outside uh, later on to make it look more bakery is is I don't know. I, I might want to put like some tables or something on the outside and do some like outdoor tables, so I don't I don't know. But I was thinking in my head that maybe we could like cook things uh, and then like like fresh things or cook them at home or whatever and just like pick and choose like what not to sell and then maybe we could just have some stuff out for people to eat or something like that. So it wouldn't be like business, it would just be kind of like uh, just a plus of coming to our bakery. But um, anyways, let me show you my few little renovations. I like put this little uh, piece over here. <laughs> I like added onto the wall, but I'll show you why. It's because I really wanted some windows right there, but um, we had the, oh, well that's a problem. We had the, um, these little things in the way, so I couldn't do it. But now we can put them against the wall. So with that, you know, being against the wall, I took away the rest of the counter space where your, your sims could go behind it, but uh, I just put the little register over here for now. I figured whatever, it'll work for now. Um, but I put a lot of stuff up for sale. So first thing I'm going to show you is that I did put some tables over here. Now I am just trying to decide on whether or not I want to keep these secluded over here in their own little space. Or if I want to have them scattered throughout the bakery, I would think it'd be more realistic if I had them scattered throughout the bakery and then had some more of these, you know, over here. Because two is definitely not enough <laughs> for me anyways. I want to put a lot more than that in here. Uh, but yeah, we can put like some tables like scattered all throughout because it's very, very empty and I don't like that. So I'm thinking I might do that instead. But for now, we're just going to put them over there. So I've got some cute pink chairs with some bows on them because they're adorable. Uh, change the wallpaper up a little bit because I uh, really wanted to use the stripes. Just kind of feeling it. Uh, put some flowers over here and then over here. Over here. <laughs> a lot of a uh, lot of time went into this section. It's still not completely filled up, but uh, I put this over here because I wanted there to be a little bit of retail to this. Uh, I mean, like as in purchasing like items and not just food. So I put a bunch of kitchen items. So we have like this little pig, you know, just like different little decorations from the kitchen uh, up here for people to buy. So it's kind of like and these like flowers and stuff. I may put those up for sale. I may not. I don't know. It depends. But um, I put those up up there so we could just sell some more stuff. And, uh, yeah. I like it. I like it. Oh, and this is what I forgot to do. Is put this over here. There we go. I was like, why does that wall look so weird? There we go. Um, but anyways, other than that, I think that's pretty much it. And, like, I like to put little, um, little things for sale by the registers, uh, to kind of make it seem like it's impulse buying you know what I mean like if you go to a store like if you go to like a grocery store and you're like waiting in line and they have all of those like there's like the candy and like there's drinks you know what I mean like when you're like at Target or something or Walmart I don't know but they have all those little things and like every once in a while you like pick something up out of there just because it's there so uh, yeah that's kind of what this is supposed to be it's kind of just like oh that looks nice let's get that on the way out as well but um yeah so let me know what you think about the tables being, like, scattered throughout. I think that would be probably the best idea. Um, yeah. Okay, so that's pretty much it. But my other idea that I wanted to tell you guys before we left, because she's, like, starving, so we're probably going to head home. Um, but I wanted to, if you'll notice, there's, like, still some empty space up here uh, on these, like, shelves. And the reason for that is because I had this idea when I was putting this stuff on here. Because, I mean, there's only so much stuff I can put on there, but, um... What if uh, we had, you know, Oliver help us out? So, like, maybe he could get creative and make some stuff. Um, either, whether that be, like, with, um, like, the handiness. What is it called? The little, uh, what is it called? Uh, I gotta look it up. The thing where they make the wood. You know what I mean? I, I did it in my uh, Disney Legacy Let's Play. Where they can uh, make 
the wooden things. God bless, where is it? Right there. The woodworking table, duh. Well, I said wood, didn't I? I'm surprised that didn't like click into my mind. Um, but anyways, uh, was thinking if maybe he could like make some like little sculptures that we could sell in here, just like just to have him kind of contribute because he's not really, uh, he's not really contributing to the um, to the bakery at all because it's mostly just Andrea's thing. But I thought it would be kind of cute if he like helped us out a little bit. So we're gonna go ahead and head home for now. We'll set all this stuff for sale later on but um yeah hey what you doing what you doing what does that s wait what did that say over his head mailman oh okay okay i don't i don't know why that like struck me as something important but anyways so uh, i thought that would be kind of cute if we had something to kind of like involve him in the bakery a little bit and also i'm still unaware or maybe i just forgot i don't know but i forgot if you guys want um uh, if you guys want Andrea to do both photography and the bakery. Or if you want um, Oliver to do the photography side of it all. And he can be the one upstairs and she can stay downstairs cooking the stuff and making the bakes. Making the bakes. Making the bakes. Yep. Making the bakes. So uh, just let me know. Let me know what you think about that. I'm going to have her go cook something. Um, I do want her to learn her actual cooking skill as well as her gourmet cooking skill because then we can make some bomb cakes. Yes. And put those in there as well. Those do qualify as baked goods. So it works for me. And uh, what time is it even? Um, okay. So he has a couple days off. But, man, I, wanna go to, I want him to go to work <laughs> really bad. But I'm going to have him just, like, keep reading this book. Maybe he'll finish it eventually. God, oh, what is this called? Loving the time of sandwiches. Okay. Is she eating this? Where is she, where'd she go? Oh. Can they not sit here? I thought they could. Oh, there's food here. What? How did that get there? What? what? Okay. I, I don't I don't know. I don't know. It's probably there from like whenever I built the house or something. Or I don't know. Maybe not. <laughs> I don't know what I'm talking about. Um, but anyways... Uh, let's see what else I can do. <laughs> I think I can have her go paint some stuff. Uh, since we were working on that. And then also, let's go paint from reference. So let's do, let's do a large, or you know what, no. Let's do a medium. Paint from reference. We'll do a medium painting. Oh, okay. I paused it on accident. Um, whoa, we are really zoomed in. So what can we take, I mean, there's not a whole lot we can do in here. But let's just take a picture of that. Fabulous. Fab. So fab. Oh, yeah! Level two! Uh, it says, don't forget those selfies. Andrea's... Okay, let's read. Andrea's face is a work of art and pictures taken with her phone help increase her photography skill level. Which is so cute, by the way. So, uh, yeah, let me know who you want to do the photography. I think, I think, from what I can remember, you guys said Andrea do both. I think. I think. But at the same time, I can remember like reading a few times where you guys were like, I don't, you know, a couple of you guys were just like, I don't care who does it. So um, if it were like, I don't know, it just seems like we could have Oliver doing it because I don't know. I feel like I'm like leaving him out because I mean, I know he's like the doctor and stuff, but I kind of want him to contribute. That's why I'm trying to find ways for him to contribute. And I accidentally cheated um, a little too much. I don't know if you guys remember, but I meant to give them 50000 I accidentally gave them $100,000. But, um, yeah. So they have like $8,000 right now, so we can pretty much afford whatever we want. But I really, really, really want to explore with aliens as well. I am definitely not forgetting about that. Uh, no way, Jose. So, um, let me see what his traits are. I honestly forgot. <laughs> oh, he, oh, yes, he's a genius. Hallelujah. We need to get abducted. I don't care if he gets pregnant. Bring it the freak on. Bring it the frick on. We are totally, totally going to try. Um, let me see. What's the, what's the best way to do it? I know that you can get, um, a spaceship and go to space. Um, if, does it work by just looking whoa that's a big telescope that's a big freaking telescope okay 
I was thinking like a little one, like tiny really really tiny oh by the way guys we didn't know this is what the little photography studio thing looks like it's super cool and uh i'm I, I don't know from what i saw in the trailer you're you could like choose what pose to put them in and i don't know i just really want to try that out looks like so much fun um is that the only telescope god bless the thing is ginormous or we could do a spaceship which I actually haven't done before. I've never built a spaceship, and that would be super freaking cool. Um, not even gonna lie, but I really kind of just like, I wanna like get it done really quick. I know that sounds like bad, but I mean, whatever. What's this? Chemical analyzer. What is this? Uh, it says this chemical analyzer combines the most up to date software and state of the art technology. Allow your sims to get the most accurate readings on all of their experiments and be the envy of all scientists in town. Plus, it also has lasers. Who doesn't like lasers? Yes, okay. We all like lasers. But uh, this is for, like, scientists, so I'm not going to get one of those, even though it looks super cool. Looks like you could chop up someone in there. Man, that looks kind of scary now that I'm getting up close. We're going to back away. But um, I am going to get one of these telescopes. I'm not actually 100% sure if this is going to work or not. Man, this thing is huge! Good thing we have room. God. Um, okay, let's just, uh, I guess we'll just plop it back here. Okie dokie. And, uh, have him come. Oh my god, we can woohoo in here? Are you kidding me? I want to see that happen. Let's do that. Let's go ahead and woohoo with them. With them, too. Um, how much longer until she finishes this painting? Oh, hey, it actually looks kind of cool now that she's painting it. How much is this worth? Enough. Are they gonna? Are they gonna? They're not gonna. They're not doing it. Okay, let's let's try it again. Let's try this again. Um, woohoo with Andrea. Oh, I feel like they haven't had any time together. <laughs> this isn't really a romance themed uh, let's play, but we can definitely uh, not forget about it. Let's not forget. Oh, the hearts come out of here. That's so cute. Look at this guy walking by, like, totally has no idea. Okay. Why is he tense? Unchallenged. Genius Sims need mental stimulation. Okay, fine. Stargaze, baby, stargaze. We gonna look for some aliens today. So you can't even, like, see him in there. Can we zoom in close enough? <laughs> the answer is no, my friends. So, he's gonna do that. I'm not even sure exactly how you would get abducted. Um, I definitely know that you can do it from going to space in the spaceship, I believe. I believe. Uh, or if you are a scientist and you, like, research them or something like that. I'm not, again, I'm not 100% on that. But, um, yeah, I'm just gonna let him stargaze and just pray. Just gonna keep praying. Um, yeah. We'll just wait for that to happen. But anyways, um, let's see what we can do. Let's have her read. Um, let me look at her skills. So her painting skill is like the, the biggest thing that she has going on for her right now. Which isn't like, that's like the last thing we're focusing on. So, uh, I don't know. But let's, um, what should we do? Oh, I know what we can do. Let's go out here and take a picture of the spaceship thingy. Let's take a photo. Yeah. Oh. Oh, oh, God. Oh, my, oh, my, that's gorgeous. We're going to take a picture of that first. Um, actually, as a matter of fact, we're going to take a little little snip, snip shot, snip shot. Um, let's make it a medium photo. What filters? What filters? That photo did not need a filter. Hashtag no filter. Am I right? <laughs> am I right? Oh, that one looks kind of cool, actually, now that I'm looking at it. So let's see. No filter or filter. Let's do filter. Beautiful. Beautiful. Let's go back. Oh. Oh. That was my bad. Okay, I thought the game, like, froze. Um, okay. Now let's take another one of, uh, the... The spaceship. Not the spaceship. The telescope. What even? Okay. <gasps> Look at the moon! Okay, I'm sorry. I'm getting, like, so distracted. Alright, let's take a photo. Uh, how should we take this? Should we do it like this? Like this. I just totally took a photo on accident. I didn't even mean to. I'm sorry. Um, we can brighten it up. That looks kind of cool. I don't really like any of these filters too much, to be honest with you. They look kind of cheesy. I do like that one, though. Okay, we'll do this one. Um, 
Okay. Oh, I made them small pictures. Oh, well, whatever. Whatevs. So let's look at our pictures in here real quick. So let's see, this one, $8, $6, and $8. Oh, okay. Man, I really want him to find some aliens. In awe of the cosmos. It's so cool. I really want to Google, like, what's the... The best way to find them. I mean, it, you, I'm assuming telescope because that's how it's always been. It may not be like that in this game, but I was just taking a little guess, little gander. But I think while we're gonna, while we're sitting here looking at this, I think I'm gonna go just head on to Google real quick. Um, let's see the Sims 4 um, aliens. Let's see how to how to uh, how to get there because there's like a whole alien world you can explore. I haven't even seen it. I haven't spoiled it for myself at all, so I don't know what it looks like at all. I'm really excited, so I really want to go see. I'm really, really excited. Um, let's see. The Sims 4 get to work. Oh, yeah. Okay, so I just did my research, and I'm not exactly sure how you get abducted, per se. Um, you may, like, you may not even need this telescope. You may just need to, like, go out here and just stargaze on your own, but, um, like, if we were just out here stargazing just like this maybe that's I don't know it didn't say I didn't read it but to get to the actual world which is called Sixum um, you have to either be in the science career or you know like the scientist career and build a portal or or you can build a spaceship and I have talked about wanting to build a spaceship in my let's plays before and I've never done it so I think I'm gonna get on that actually I think I'm gonna get on that um, I think we have enough money we do yes Oh, awesome! Okay. So let's see, do we want the blue one, the brown one, or the black one? Let's get the black one. Black one, black one looks really cool. Let's get that one and put it right there. Oh my god, awesome! Alright, so let's put this over here. We'll have it kind of off to the corner. And uh, then we'll put the spaceship, like, right there. Cool. Awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Okay, so we are for definitely going to be uh, working on that spaceship. I've always wanted to build one, guys, and I have yet to do it, so I am pretty excited. But now I have, like, a legitimate reason to build a spaceship. But, um, yeah. Yeah. So I really, really, really want to see them get abducted as well as travel to the actual world itself like that oh my god i would just make my life so i think we're going to do the we're going to do the the spaceship thing for sure definitely for sure we are going to be doing that oh i just hit my microphone i apologize but i yeah, i'm really excited to do that too because aliens guys aliens <laughs> need i say more um aliens look she's gonna go bake some more more baked goods. I mean, don't make the pre-mixed brown the pre-mixed brownies. I mean, we can make so much more. We can make so much more. Uh, fish pie. Oh, okay. Uh huh. Oh. Okay. Uh, cereal marshmallow squares. Breakfast of champions. Mm -hmm. So basically, um, what's the, oh my god, what is that breakfast called? I mean, that that breakfast. That cereal. <gasps> Oh no! Lucky Charms? Uh, yeah, yeah, Lucky Charms. That's the one, right? Please, please let that be the right one. But the marshmallows, Ooh. right? But they taste like actual, like, heaven on earth. But the rest of the cereal is really bad, in my opinion. In my opinion. I've, I've met people that like this cereal too. But to me, the actual cereal tastes like cardboard, but the marshmallows taste like heaven. And I mean, like, they don't taste like marshmallows. I'm not even a huge marshmallow person, but they taste like so good, guys. So good. Oh, I'm getting emotional. Uh, yeah. Could really go for some right now. Oh my god, wait, wait. Cereal marshmallow squares. These look like Rice Krispie treats. Definitely not like any Lucky Charms. That would be, I mean, if we could get the Lucky Charms, like the marshmallow part in this size. <gasps> Go ahead and buy me 10 boxes because that, oh man. Oh, we's going to get fat today. That would be amazing. Um, yeah, but anyways, let, now that we've completely gotten off track, um, yeah, we're just kind of like, ah. just kind of waiting because he does have a few days off. So I think 
for the next few days, I am going to have him intense, intensely working on that spaceship because it's freaking awesome. And uh, yeah, I'm really, really excited. I don't know anything about the spaceships or the astronauts or anything like that. So I haven't done anything like that. It's all new to me. Nothing is spoiled. So I'm pretty excited. You're going to see my true reactions. Uh, he's going to go grab some marshmallows, where's... <gasps> wait! Wait, 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 wait. Come back. Somebody come back. Come open this again. <gasps> wait. Come back. Come, um, come over here and, like, you're gonna make a salad. Okay, wait, wait, guys, wait. Pause. <gasps> oh my god, there's a freezer bunny in there! Has it always been in there? Have I just not noticed? Oh my god. So cute. You don't have to actually make that salad. I mean, you guess you can since we're here and you're you're already making it but um okay you sir go use the restroom please please and thank you and then we're gonna go work on a spaceship have you guys seen the lego movie and that little guy he's like spaceship <laughs> i love him he said it like 50 times in a row oh my god it was amazing i was laughing so hard build for a thousand dollars okay so on top of spending five thousand to get this little platform you also have to spend a thousand to start building oh Oh, that's massive. I don't know what I was expecting. It's a freaking rocket ship. Uh, he can now build rockets. Okay, well, um, my, <laughs> uh, my microphone decided to stop recording a while ago, which was frustrating. Um, so, what, let me tell you what you missed. Uh, we started working on this, which he's still working on, so you haven't missed anything crazy uh but also in here i deleted this little wooden thing that we have that i thought was like connected or was telling you guys that it was like that's how what i was imagining um but i thought we would put our little pictures here so those pictures that we took with uh her camera last night we put right here so there's like the little little telescope thingy and then there's that house that i really like really like that right there but I really want to get her painting school up uh, as well as, as her photography because I do want to be able to have her paintings put up on display in her uh, photography studio and um, we can sell them as kind of like an art gallery as well. So that's pretty cool. Um, but yeah, so I really want to get that done as well. So I think I'm going to wrap this part up here. Hopefully in the next part we will definitely be able to explore a little bit more with the uh rocket ship and that will be really fun and then um eventually we will be going back to work with him uh as a doctor so it's kind of like he's doing the scientist thing at home but he's just not going as far into detail as he could but eventually i do want to um i definitely want to have someone in this family do the scientist career and of course the detective career um don't forget about that one guys i always forget about that one that's why i'm reminding you don't be like me but um yeah so i hope you guys enjoyed this part as always if you have any ideas or suggestions please leave them in the comments below and um yeah i will talk to you all in my next video bye guys <laughs>